uh, undercover plain clothes men like themselves who uh, are in dis disguises and they look they look like uh, junkies walking around in the area and they're supposed to make direct buys from individuals engaged in narcotic traffic the way it's done uh, they don't make the, the buys in all cases and in many cases it's it's just an absolute uh, finger job by the uh, undercover agent he is supplied with uh, the narcotics that he says he has bought off the individuals by the team that he's working with. In other words, uh, they'll give him like maybe 10 decks of heroin and he'll go out and he'll say, if he sees someone that's working in the street who looks like a, a junk dealer or who in fact is a junk dealer, uh, he'll say, okay, I, I just bought two decks off him, go in and make his records, turn in two decks of heroin and then the fellow is arrested. Uh, the money that was... The question, you said they give him the team he's working with, uh, each uh, undercover agent is assigned to a certain amount of, of uh, other detectives to work in the narcotic enforcement. There might be maybe uh, eight or ten men assigned to one undercover man. Uh, the money that he is supposed to use for buying the, the drugs is goes in his pocket. And in some, some cases, it's up to $60 a day that he makes and buys. The cases go to court. The undercover agent. The uh, cases go to court, and in many instances, these people who are told they had bought narcotics are in fact narcotics dealers. They don't know if they have bought from an undercover agent or not, and in a lot of cases, they plead guilty to the charges, which are reduced at the time to, uh, instead of getting five years, they might plead guilty and get a year and a half or two years, possibly two and a half years. Uh, <coughs> are there... Uh Scores as well in connection with these operations? Yes, there are scores involved in the large narcotic operations. And how does that work? Well, a man is, man is uh, arrested or let go and money is involved, money is taken. Money is involved in court cases involving narcotics.